so we thin, we get encampments, we get a gold or trove, we try to win encampment, split, wait, oh, you drew me a card. That's actually really, really nice. And we can keep these around with mule. I think I'm going to take money and grab a gold here. Now we're going to trash and take another encampment. We're eventually going to need plus buy off of you guys, but uh, it's not that big a priority. This is fine. Just take another encampment here. I assume you're going to take one here as well. Okay, we know that the gold is down here, so we can play this with impunity. Um, question is how we order our fives here. We can five every turn. I think we, the plunders are just really important, so there is no substitute. for winning the pun plunder split. Which we actually cannot do. Okay, great. But I guess we can build bigger anyway. Um, I guess we're taking the money here, assuming that you can get this plunder. I'd like to trash, but... This is going to be this now because the plus buy seem, seems important and we'll try to get like Lost City and Charm well maybe not not Lost City right just a uh, lab is better Charms. Uh, this is not so great. Okay, you took more labs. should want to not lower so much probably. Uh, 
I don't think you can win this turn, though. Maybe I could have taken lab there. So this is going to be province and something. And peddlers, right? So you have 14 money right now. Maybe a little bit more. Um, you had 14, 15, 16, 17, theoretically, maybe a little more than that. I can go province, province, draw card, and a bunch of peddlers here. I can come very close to emptying. I mean, I can empty. Okay, so we need to, we need to score quite a bit here, I think. I couldn't lower charms or labs because I think that lets you win. Now I need to have a good draw this turn and I may be okay, but I also am not sure that I'll be okay. You're drawing much better than me, of course. I'm gonna take the buy and the buy and the buy. You only have four money here. If you buy out the peddlers, then that's no good for you. I mean, it all just depends on what I'm able to do on my turn. Which is far, far from guaranteed. Because my draw is significantly iffier than yours. Estate, estate, peddler, peddler, okay. Well, that's gone. There's going to be one of these left. I 
could take like a lab and three duchies. World Lost City and three duchies. There's going to be an encampment left in the pile. You have three charms, which means you have four gains. You can also take a bunch of provinces. I think I'm supposed to take Lost City and three duchies. I'm going to have a hard time drawing again next turn, though. And I can take one of these safely, I believe. But not two. OK. Um. Yeah, I overpressed the charms here. You can double province and estate. It's going to be a bit hard for me to beat. Probably you'd also take a peddler because lowering is probably good for you. Oh, you're taking encampment. Okay. I'm less sure how good this is for you. Of course, I still need to draw, which is still not easy. And I've done exactly draw. We're always going to take this for money. I guess we're not always, because it depends. OK. Discard a card for a peddler. If I do that, then five charms is five duchies. is a point short and that doesn't even help me empty okay what about so I could empty peddlers and estates here and lose 15 25 money I can get two provinces a duchy and an estate I I lose exactly on a, on the tie. I think if I do that. I could get to 23. No, I can get to 21. Okay. Here's how we do it. Buys, 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 then gains gains, we get two duchies and two provinces. And win. Yeah! Okay! Well, it paid off in the end. Thanks for watching.